Hey everyone, it's Clara from Brew Blend Bliss and tonight is Sunday night so that means it's coffee maker cleaning night. Um, I don't clean my coffee maker every day, I just clean it on Sundays and give it a good thorough cleaning. And so I'm going to walk you through, according to the manual, um, how to clean your coffee maker and then also give you a bonus tip of something that I discovered that was completely revolutionized how easy it was for me to clean my coffee maker. So the first thing I'm going to show you is what you can put in the dishwasher. So you can put the crap and the lid and you just bank it off. Uh, you can put that in the dishwasher as well as you can put the filter basket in the dishwasher. So what you're left with is just the coffee maker and make sure before you do any cleaning, you unplug it. Now, um, for just wiping down the coffee maker, all you're going to need really is just a cloth. So you can just wipe it down, a damn cloth, put a little bit of water on it. You're good to go. Now the, to clean the inside of it, um, you're going to want to run a pot of coffee and you can do that with this one with vinegar. So you can actually put two cups of vinegar in the water reservoir and then you just hit brew. And so you let the vinegar go through. Um, now that's according to the manual that you can use vinegar uh, for other coffee pots, unless it specifically says in the manual that you can. I always recommend not using vinegar because vinegar is very acidic and it can erode certain plastic parts. Um, but this one is made so that you can use vinegar, which vinegar is an awesome way to clean um, and get, you know, all the kind of the cruddy stuff that builds up in your coffee maker. So you'll run through, you'll just brew um, the vinegar and then after that, um, and make sure you put a filter, I would go ahead and put a filter in your coffee pot. Um, and obviously you're gonna wanna do all this before you put the craft in the dishwasher. <laughs> Otherwise you will have vinegar all over your countertop. Um, but run it, run the vinegar through and then run it again with just plain water a couple times just to make sure all the vinegar residue is gone because um, that would taste pretty nasty with your coffee. So um, now the tip, the tip that I have for you um, is because coffee makers just have like so many nooks and crannies and so I use a bottle brush to clean mine. Um, I, I get one with a sponge on the end and so I just get it lightly wet and then especially you know like the basket area um, there's just so many like little nooks and crannies around there and so it's just so much easier get this a little wet, scrub it all down in there, and then you're done. And it's just a little easier than using a cloth. For the outside body of the coffee maker, using a cloth works great. Um, but I just found that a bottle brush, especially on the inside, just works a little bit better. So uh, give this video a thumbs up, and I hope that this was helpful. And until we meet again next time, have an awesome day.